Because like Baruch Hamorning Abotai, even when a person prays Arvit early, either at Shkiah or a little bit before Shkiah by Plaga Mincha, like we spoke about the past few days, nevertheless a person is obligated to repeat Kriyat Shema Shel Arvit, the nighttime Kriyat Shema, when the proper time for the mitzvah comes, which is at Tzete Kohavim. Tzete Kohavim, according to the Geonim, during this time of year, is give or take 15 minutes or so after Shkia, after sunset. Even though it's a little bit, still, uh, still a little bit light outside, it's still considered Tzete Kohavim. Nevertheless, Maran Tachonot Baracha writes in Alichot Olam, wherever possible, to repeat Kriyat Shema Shel Arvit after Tzete Kohavim Shel Rabbeinu Tam, wherever, because it is mitzvah Asim in Torah, Therefore, wherever possible, if you can do it after um, Rabbeinu Tam, which is 72 minutes after Shkiyaz Maniot, Matovu Manayim. Now, here's the issue. Wherever possible, a person should also try to do Kriyat Shema, to repeat Kriyat Shema, besides for Kriyat Shema She'al Mitla, which means, even sometime during the night, irrelevant of the fact that you're going to be saying Kriyat Shema Mitla, preferably don't wait for that to be Yotzei the Mitzvah. Try to say Kriyat Shema, when you're repeating Kriyat Shema, try to say it before then, when you're sitting down somewhere on the couch, on the table, doesn't matter. Bidiabad, if a person mm. forgot, or he didn't get a chance to repeat Kriyat Shema, and now he's already on his bed, now it's already time for Kriyat Shema Ala Mita, the Allah is, he is able to use Kriyat Shema Ala Mita, especially according to Tzfaradim. According to Tzfaradim, Kabbalah, we do, for Kriyat Shema Sh- Ala Mita, we say all three parashiyot. Not like Minhag Ashkenazim, not like the Minhag of the Shulchan Aruch, that they only say the Ahavta, only the first parasha. We say all three. So over there, if you didn't say it until now, you can use Kriyat Shema Sha'alamita, but you must have specific Kavana. I'm having Kavana to be Yotzeh Mitzvat Aseh Shil Kriyat Shema Sha'alamita, and then you can kill two birds with one stone. It'll work both for the Mitzvah of Kriyat Shema and also for the Shemira of Kriyat Shema Sha'alamita. Yom Tov.